guys. Good morning, good morning, man. I'm back at it again. We're in the lab. In the lab. Yeah, I took the vet out. Uh, need, a, need a little room here. Reese popped in on me. I had to fix his third brake light. So, yeah, that's that's why this car is out. Normally, it'll be in here. But, yeah, so, yeah, I see that door open over there. We working on that door, man. So, I took the panel off already. So, this is the window kit. Yeah, that's the kit that come with all the, the caps, the, the, um, the adapters for the window, the crank that go on there. You got your switch up and down switch. Oh, no, nah, we don't need that. That was for that was for Reese this morning. But yeah, that's it. That got the brackets, the whole lat, uh, actuators. Come on out, man. Come on out. Yeah, got these actuators. High. These heavy duty actuators. That's for his door locks. Yep. Alright, guys, let me go ahead and, and take this door panel off. Finish taking this door panel off and uh, possibly get one of these, these window motors on. And uh, I'll show you how it works. Alright, I'll be right back later. Alright guys, went on and got this one one window window motor in. Right now. Oh, let me show you how real. Yeah, I got it in. I got it tucked in right there. So I'll put a screw in right there. And it snuck a screw in right there. Y'all see that? And yeah, that's holding the motor on. So the motor came out. Came up. Boom. First, I had to on that on that right there. See that other little piece in the middle right there? That's what this is. That's what that is. That goes on the crank first, and then this top part go on, and then your window window motor go over that. Y'all see the gear? Yeah, the gear go on that right there. See? Yeah, guys, it was pretty, pretty simple, man. But you know, you gotta have common sense doing this stuff. Yeah, I got it wired, wired up to my battery. We are gonna see how it works. Let's see what what happens, man. Boom. Okay. Let's go down with it. Down is black, huh? Okay. Now see how that works. See, it turns the crank. I wired, wired tied that down. That cable was sticking out because of the, the twist on it. But yeah, man, I bolted it down. That's the cable that's going inside. I made two holes. Put my grommets there too. See the grommets? I did that. These was, it was just bare, flat metal. Yeah, see that? Yeah, but that's gonna be right. I'm gonna put a loom, loom on that, but. I say yeah, it's pretty simple, man. It's pretty simple. So I'm gonna start on these door locks right now, and uh, get these door locks so I can just run right in and be done with that. So I can get on this push start. That's that's gonna be easy too. These old cars, man, it's super easy. So that's what it is. All right, guys, I'll be back in a minute. Peace. All right, guys. I done assessed the door. I done assessed the door and see what I need to do to get to this door. I see that right there, that's the door lock. And you can see it moving in there. See that little that little bar right there? Yeah, that's this. So, I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to cut a little hole. Probably just cut this section out so I can get to that bar. Cut that section out. I'm gonna use that little guy right there. Yeah, so I'm gonna cut that section out so I'll be able to get to that. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there, man. All right, guys, let me get to it. All right, I'll let you in a second. All 
All right, guys, went on ahead and opened that little little access door up for me, man. Let me show y'all. All right, so y'all can see that little bar in there now. That I can get to it, no problem. Yep, and that's what the door lock is gonna connect to. Yep, so yeah, I'm showing y'all how to do power door locks, man, on old school. So, I'm giving y'all a free game right now. All right, all right, so. That's what it is, man. Let me go ahead and hook this up. I'll show you the results when I'm done. All right, peace. All right, guys. Went on and got this, got this uh, actuator in the door, man. So, yeah. Yeah, went on and got the actuator in the door. See them two screws right there? That's what's holding the actuator in there. Let me get my light real quick. Let me get my light. So, yeah, I can see it in there. Yeah, that's oh, crap. Yeah, it's in there. There it is right there. Okay. All right, guys. Yeah, I just gotta wire this up, wire this one door up, and I'll be done with these door locks and windows, man, real quick. So I can start on this push start. I'm gonna be done with this car today. Today. Okay, y'all seeing the light outside. Somebody coming in. All right, man, let me wire this up. I'm going to show y'all what it looked like when I put it back together. All right, peace. All right, guys, I went on and wrapped this dough up, man, because I got to get this car done. Customer just called, man. and Yeah, but got this door put together got the switches in got the cover oh i'm sorry got the cover for the uh for the door handle for the crank uh got my loom going through the door with the grommets and uh yeah the other the other line power wire is is ran over on the passenger side already i just gotta put some ignition to that and these windows should be working fine and then uh, put a put the push button start on here so he can have the door locks with the keyless entry. Yeah, let me show you this door panel. Yep, that's the switches. See the crank gone. The crank is gone. That wire right there, that's the door lock wires. That's for the door lock. Uh, yeah, got that wire ran over there already. Over there already. For the uh, for the door locks and the and the power windows got that done already so next stage step is the other door then i'm gonna come back over here on the driver's side and hook the hook some power up and yeah because the battery did he left the ignition on or the accessory on i was wondering why that light was on on the passenger side so but yeah he said he accidentally left that on and uh but i got the charge on it now i got lights in <laughs> Dome light zone now, but yeah, uh, yeah. Let me go ahead and knock this other side out real quick, and uh, we should be up and running, man, before the end of the day. So, all right, guys, I'll get back to you in a quick second. Later. Alright guys, it's the end of the day, man. I got these doors in. Got the power locks in. Um, let me show you. Got the door, the, the window motors in, the windows. Did that side over there too. Y'all see that? Yeah, got the push start in there too. That's what this is. Y'all see it blinking? That's because it's picking up the remote. That's why it's blinking. So I'm gonna power this up, power that up, and we're gonna let this window down. Yep, we're gonna do that side over there. Ooh. Yep. And we're gonna do the starter too. Step on this brake 
and press this button right here. Step on the brake. Press the button and stop. Stop it too. Well, all right, guys, I'm pretty much finished, man. I'm going to come in in the morning and square it off, and uh, I'm going to go over it again with y'all. But uh, we're going to go ahead and finish this video. We're going to end this video. If y'all new to this this channel, y'all just not seeing me, uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, that like button, and that share button, and the notification bell to let you know when I'm dropping these new videos, man. So, all right, and on that note, we're going to go ahead and end this, and y'all have a good night. And I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.